Welcome to my home. Today we are making a barbecue Bloody Mary using our barbecue vodka. That's the stuff right here. Uh, if you have not made it, check out the day I make that barbecue vodka. It came inspired from BB, or I'm sorry, from BK Barbecue. Check out his channel. Brian's channel is really cool. This is one of those great vodkas or Bloody Marys that you could have on a barbecue day. It tastes so good, and I wanna stress this. This is such a cool Bloody Mary. All you are going to need is a barbecue vodka, just a shot in there, and then Bloody Mary mix. If you have want to make your own Bloody Mary mix, hit that button right there, the eye in the sky. That'll take you to the day where we made Bloody Mary mix, one of my favorites, or you can just buy Bloody Mary mix. Put that in there. My shaker has ice cubes in it already. I'm going to shake this up. You can drink this with ice cubes, you can drink it without ice cubes. Now the fun part about this is, it does not need anything. It doesn't need the pepper, it doesn't need the salt, doesn't need anything. Pour it into the glass. Oh, look how rich and wonderful that looks. All right, let's give it the taste. Ooh, that is smooth and rich and wonderful. This is a really thick and rich Bloody Mary. This tastes amazing. I love this Bloody Mary. If you're gonna make a Bloody Mary, if you have people who aren't sure they like Bloody Marys, try this. This is a Bloody Mary that is tangy, has that zip, and yet has the exciting part of the barbecue sauce, which makes it even more special. If you make this, let me know. You can get a hold of me on most social media at CM Coleman Home. If this is your first time here, don't forget to subscribe. Every Thursday is a cocktail, and we do exciting cocktails like this. So I hope you come back and see me again. And remember, why buy it when you can make it yourself?